72 and a half kilograms, but this one at 70 under full Muay Thai rules, folks. So throws and sweeps and elbows and all the rest are legal under these Muay Thai rules here. However, this one just three rounds of three minutes and immediately they go into the clinch, taking full advantage of the rule set here. Unlike his brother Enrico, does prefer to fight under Muay Thai rules, although Enrico has fought a number of times under Muay Thai rules as well. He, most of his fights are under kickboxing rules these days. Hello! Uppercut! Uppercut by Kale and a back elbow! He's got him in a headlock now. He really rocked Heinz now in the Mad Hatter. Watch out for the elbows of Kale. He knows full well how to take advantage of the rules here. And a tricky little kick, and look at this. Heinz now is, looks like he's walking on stilts, but still has the presence of mind to throw that downward elbow strike. Wow, when he throws that spinning back elbow, has bad, bad intentions written all over it. As we approach 30 seconds left in round one of being in the clinch. Some reddening in that area. Heinz now, a lot and, of holding uh, and clinching Kunde. throughout that round, perhaps just to buy him some time. On the ring five for the zweite Runde, round two. It's gotta be a big advantage too for Kale to have his brother Enrico in the corner. I know that they train together, they work together constantly. And, and they're, they're blood relatives too. So it's always a big advantage to have somebody like that in your corner. Look at that, doubled up with the right kick, one to the body, one upstairs to the jaw. Kale has oftentimes just pinpoint accuracy and perfect timing when he releases the clinch and then either throws a knee or an elbow of some sort. Oh my! Speaking of elbows, that one just absolutely blasted Jason Hines. He doesn't have a clue where he is right now. How on earth is this fight continuing? Kale now, like a shark smelling blood, going to work now on Hines. Hines for the second time in this matchup in serious, serious trouble. He's still looking very glossy eyed. He's trying to move around the ring and show that he's still in this thing, but he's very wobbly, very wobbly. Is that and the end of the round? Swamp That's water. it. Holy smoke. Third and final round here. Can Hines survive another three minutes in the ring with Kale. Under these rules too, folks, don't count out Heinz either. Those elbows can easily cause a stoppage. He can land an elbow just like Kale did, could turn the, the tide of this fight completely. Kale looking for that elbow again, but he got caught up, tangled up in the arms of the Mad Hatter. Fourteen centimeters taller, to be precise, on paper. And it is Kampfes. End of the fight. 30 to 26 for the old and new Mixed Fight World Champion, Aus der Routine Ecke.